Hello students, today I am going to show you a quick way to record your lecture notes so that you don't have to worry about going through your lectures online, listening to them and trying to write every single little thing down. This feature in Google Docs should be used in order to help you write your notes, but not use it, it to write your notes for you. So what we're going to do is we're going to set it up real quick. We're going to go over to tools. We're going to click on voice typing and you're going to notice this little guy pop up with instructions to click to speak. When we click it right now, you can see that it's picking up my voice to record information. However, if I was to play audio through my computer, it would not pick that up. So we have to switch around some functions on our computer to change that. So I'm going to click off of it right now, enter down a few, and go down to my speaker icon down here, right click on it, go to open sound settings, click on that. This is your sound settings. Um, your output are going to be your speakers, and your input right now is the microphone array. It might be different for you on a, uh, if you're using something else, but we're going to change it over to stereo. These are going to change it to our speakers so that when the computer records, it's going to record information coming from our stereo. So I'm going to play this. You might not be able to hear it real well because the program that I'm using, but rest assured you will be seeing that Google Docs is going to be recording it. So when I click play on my lecture, or in this case, this is a presentation from our office. I'm going to follow up by clicking on the record button. So always click the record button after you click play or else this will turn off. Now, I know that this ended by saying through disability services. And I, we also know it did not say that in our audio play the Jedi. It said in today's agenda. So what you'll notice is that it may not pick up everything 100% as it was spoken in your lecture. And that's why we never want to use this in replacement of our notes. We always use it with our notes because there is some information that may not uh, be processed correctly. I want to remind you all that this is a normally a function to pick up on your voice while you are speaking um, to your computer. Uh, sometimes it can be used in class to pick up in lecture. When you're in class, you can take notes this way. But right now, while we're working remotely and we have a virtual setting or online classes, we just wanted to share with you how you could use the audio on your computer in order to help you with taking your notes at home. Google Docs is a free service. You do not have to pay for it. There are other programs now that are using voice to text technology. Your cell phones can use it. You can also try using Microsoft Word. The new version has a dictate function. However, I'm not sure if switching your audio um, like we did um, in this video is something that will work with Microsoft Word, but if you have the function, you can always try it. I hope this helps you with your note-taking skills this semester, and I wish you the best of luck.